Hello everyone, once again welcome to Cricket Chat, YouTube, uh, YouTube channel. And uh, today we are joined by uh, Pushka Shama. Pushka Shama is a Waraka uh, Sports Club uh, player. And for those that uh, follow cricket, uh, uh, local cricket, will remember that Pushka Shama was the highest week uh, uh, run scorer last season in NPC League. And uh, last week he led his side again. He was uh, part of the team that uh, played in opening match against uh, Nairobi, Nairobi Jimkana, where you lost by uh, one wicket. Yeah. Uh, before we before we start this conversation, Pushka, probably will tell us what happened. Because as far as I'm concerned, uh, you only just needed eight. Uh, you needed only two wickets to win the match, and uh, with uh, 90 runs required. Yeah, when uh, you know we did uh, 171, so 172 was uh, winning the score. The score was 172. And then Jim Khanna came and uh, Vishil Patel was doing good job in the bowling and Sachin Gill also. So Jim Khanna was 80 for it. And then Lucas came and the one guy, the youngster like Atharu. So Arnav. So he, they both uh, played well and then he, this, Lucas played well, good many sixes and then they won the match. Uh, is there something that didn't work out for you when, uh, in, uh, during that period? Yeah, uh, let me tell you, this is a good thing because of the, the very first match which uh, we have seen the words so we have to improve for the coming matches. Mm -hmm. So, we was like shortage for the uh, one fast bowler. We added one batsman in that match and then Sachin Gill was only the fast bowler in the match. I was in the new ball with Sachin Gill, I was giving support with the new ball. And then we see he, we need one more bowler for the coming NPCA league. Mm -hmm. So, in the very first match, we learned something about the match. We lost the match, it's a different thing, but we learned something about the game and then we improve in the next match. So, apart from your having a one, one less bowler, what's the other thing that you learned in that match? Uh, I think uh, in that wicket, the rainy season was rainy season is here. So, wicket was not good and then we all out on 71. And then no one, Anish uh, Chaudhary was scored and 41 runs. And then I scored 75. So, I think 171 is a not a good score in 50 overs. But uh, our bowlers were doing good job. I think uh, next time we have to score at least minimum 230 to 40 in uh, any matches. Then we bowlers can do anything. Yeah, bowlers need some uh, runs to stop to uh, against him. So we le learn uh, batsmen also think about how to prove. Yeah, two three batsmen got early wickets. So I think batsmen have to take responsibility or bowlers what whatever they are playing just give 100 percent. Okay, apart from uh, okay, something that happens you might. Uh... Your batsman might, as a batsman, you might not have uh, the best day, and uh, you end up no sco uh, scoring runs that uh, are not good for the team. But do you think you've got uh, players that can uh, get to those scores that you're talking about? Yeah, yeah, of course, yes, because you know uh, this is the first match, and after a long time we are playing a cricket match on Sunday. So in very first match, uh, batsman, everyone, you know, everyone needs some matches to do something for the team. Mm -hmm, yes. So yeah. This is good. I scored 170, 75. It's fine, but I also missed the century. If I do, did 100 runs and then team score is different. So as for me, my score was less because of team allowed 172. Because when I was playing 140 for five, I got out and 140, 172 team is allowed. So simple thing is there. Batsman is there. Just do something for the team. If he scored individually, team score below 23. And uh, uh, Pushkar, last season, uh, as I said at the beginning of this. Uh, this converse this interview uh last season you were the top scorer of the league and uh, is there something that uh are you, are you planning to maintain the same uh performance so that uh, by the end of the season again once again pushka shama is the top scorer you know uh, i forgot the last season yes. whatever i did that was the last season this is my new season this is my every match is a new match yes new ground new wickets every batsman have to do start from zero mm -hmm. so yeah i was the highest scorer it's fine but my target was 1000 runs in the last season so i which you missed by yeah i missed by once uh, 59 runs mm -hmm. but the same target is for this year also mm -hmm. so a i will go for runs. 1000 runs. a thousand runs yeah and you think uh, with the bowling of the national with the bowling of the in the league do you think you're going to do that uh, I have believe myself. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know who is bowling for me, but I believe myself. Yeah, I can do runs in that NPC league. Okay. So, uh, talking, uh, talking that you are talking, you are so comfortable, you are so comfortable, confident mm -hmm. of having a similar or better performance than last year. Uh, how is your training? How do you train, or uh, 
how do you manage to get this because my confidence because of my training yes. because i'm doing so some, how do you train yeah yes. uh, uh, you know if i have an office in the afternoon or morning when i'm leaving mm -hmm. so i will come in the evening at four o'clock so i will do training with the team if kenyan practice is there sometimes i join yes yeah. i remember you trained with yeah. the national team for so about a month or so some improvements also coming from uh, i am joining the team kenyan yes. team yeah. so i'm planning uh, doing cricket practice in the team so i know something new what i am doing in the wicket some new bowlers are there so this is good things is happening uh, in dwarka sports club cricket kenya practice is going on mm -hmm. so some uh, on a week two three days i am going i have to join the practice so i will face the new ball new pace bowlers good spinners so this is good thing for me if i am doing practice myself and my office and both things i am doing so this will help me in the match uh this you are this probably is your third season in uh, npc league anything that you've picked about our local league something that uh, stands out from our local league compared to other leagues that you played before yeah you know i last year i also said it npc league we can compare to ranji trophy and what i am telling you every year npc is improving what i am saying what i am seeing from last 3 years every year npc is improving some what are those improvements that you are seeing like you know uh, they are working on empiring yes. they are working on the empires and then some good grounds and then you know teams are calling from india or pros so mm -hmm. some compet competition is coming mm -hmm. so npc league is the key of the cricket kenya the key tournament of cricket kenya mm -hmm. so from my side npc is very good tournament whatever i playing in india or anywhere npc is same in what i am playing in india ranji trophy i was not playing ranji trophy but you know ranji trophy tournament and in kenya npc is the same tournament competition is same then uh we are we are nowhere near india as far as uh, talent is concerned or as far as the performance is concerned kenya is still struggling to get to to get to the top what 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 are we doing different that we are not getting to the level of in, of uh, india yeah. whom you are referring uh, uh, because if you talk about ranji trophy you are referring to india top domestic tournament uh, event you know as per player i can share my feelings what i am yes. seeing yes. so I have also my level. I can give. My, I am a batsman. I can give runs only. I can't do that. Ki I can do. I will do. Can you do something for Kenya? Kenya will go here. No. I am my something. That level is different. People are there. They will see. It, they will work. Think on the rest of the things. Either like our chairman or whatever. After three years, you faced a number of bowlers. Uh, maybe. In, in, a, in a number of tournaments, yeah. you say be it yeah. to 20 yeah. and be it 50 overs. Any bowler that stands out that you say that actually is a bowler that uh, I've, I like facing, or uh, whenever I, I face him, I have got uh, I usually get a lot of challenge. Ah, <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, but you know, uh, sometimes uh, bowlers have also good day. Mm -hmm. uh, doesn't matter that every time, every day you will get good shots or good shots. Yeah, sometimes. Two, three ball. Some spinner is there. You know, I'm I'm doing practice with the Rohit Sports Club. One, one spinner is there, Vishal Patel. He is a youngster. Sometimes, yeah, he is learning a lots of things. He is a uh, only 17 year old. So we are trying to improve him because you know, if he uh, if he motivate himself, he will uh, do something for him. Then he, this is good for a cricket Kenya and him also. So I think Vishal Patel sometimes puts a good ball. But okay. You've not answered my question. Okay. My question is, you faced a number. Vishil is from Boraka. Yeah. You hardly face him in the league. Okay. I'm talking about uh, when you come up at uh, against a different team. Any bowler or two bowlers that have stood out, you say that actually this is a very good bowler that I like to face. Ah, uh, you know, uh, when I was playing last year, I don't uh, don't know the name, but you know, sometimes uh, bowlers was uh, good in a like new ball with a new ball. So that that time we decided. He just uh, now bowler times is there. Just we will patience. If we go for runs, we will they will get out because the bowling that bowler is going for a good line. So I think that time just uh, forget the your shots. Just pay, pay patience. Wait for the loose ball and continue. I thought I don't think so. If uh, uh, one bowler is there to take, create problems, yeah, that's not a point. Uh, about uh, the, uh, the league has started. Australians are defending champions. Yeah. Um, is there any team that? Uh, Of course, when you're playing for your team, you are expect you are able to fight to to match victorious and win the the the, the 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 league. Any other team that you look apart from Waraka and Australia, a team that you feel will be a team to watch this year. You know, uh, this time we have a focus to go up uh, the champion. Our focus is only champion. 
Uh, we lost the match first match doesn't matter but uh, we doesn't care ki who, whoever is there in the against team but we have to win on the matches we are playing against stress can be swami whoever is there just we have to win the match this is our target but apart from apart from your team which other team do you think is going to challenge your team i think uh, swami hope and can be is a good team so and these two teams are already have a good name and in every year they will throw two three two three numbers so i think this, we have to take responsibility against these two teams uh you mentioned that uh, you trained with the national team when they were going to Uganda uh, for the ICC World Cricket Challenge uh, tournament uh, which was uh, end of last month you trained for them for about 3 uh, to 4 3 to 4 three to 4 weeks and uh with your performance in the league we expected that uh, you are going to get in the league you are going to play but you are okay we are those people that are closer to our cricket no actually what happened are you still going to fight for that place to get in the team ah you know uh, yeah i did practice with the kenyan team that's true and 3 uh, 4 weeks i was the, with the kenyan team uh, we have a good batsman we have a good bowler we have a good team and the specially thing we have a good management like coach uh, the point is in the main time who is scoring uh, if you are scoring here and you are going to play in any match and that time you don't scoring so that time the main time you have to score for the country you are representing country yes. okay you are scoring in the selection match is fine no problem you are select you are scoring here because of the score you are going there yeah if you go there don't be relax that time you have to start again at that time if you score you will name will get a uh, highlight you know uh, in uh, kenyan team raki patel is there yes. a very very good batsman and very responsibility batsman and uh, that time uh, one match was there and uh, he was uh, uh, batting alone no one was standing in so i think if we play together i think we can beat any team as a batsman do you think uh, why why you disappointed with the performance of the batters in uganda ah uh, you know yeah batsman uh, was trying good yeah but uh, okay irfan karim rusa patel is also good batsman lex obenda did one century but uh, it's okay so it happens but you know but these batsmen you can't say ki this batsman is not good the name is there you know is this this names are very famous in kenya yeah, yeah sometimes they no score sometimes rakib will score sometimes uh, collins will score sometimes rushab sometimes karim so this is a team yeah one time they they not did it no problem but the next tour will come they will definitely will do it were you disappointed by were you happy with the performance of the batsman uh, no i was i was not happy with the batsman but Yeah, if we are there doing hard working here every day. I, today also I joined back this, but mm. I think this this tour will do something. Kenya will team will do something this tour. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, last question. Uh, Any time we come to Waraka, we see you do a number of uh, a number of jobs. A number of jobs you coach. You coach uh, when you go time you coach kids here. Yeah? Uh, what do you think is the future of uh, Kenyan cricket? The future. is depend on youngsters if you have youngsters your future is secure so i think uh, we have to work on youngsters player youngsters is the key player if you do something to him he will improve in coming years yes. yeah yeah i know kenyan team that in a today that they just very senior team but if you work with a youngsters player that's why i will try to put youngsters in the team because if we if we learn today he will give you after 3 years 2 3 years so yeah kenyan have also youngsters players you know very good young good youngsters players and then npc is also uh, providing division 2 so division 2 very young players and It's giving other other yeah, young players so this is very good for kenya mm-hmm. youngsters players will learn and they will join practice they will do something that the kenyan team will also, uh, automatically improve uh last question if you look at uh, the the first matches of npc uh, npc this season uh, like there was a number of performance from uh, a number of positive performance good performance from uh, professionals that came from uh, either india or pakistan we got uh, uh sarali sarali uh, one of the pros mm. uh, did well with yeah. the bat scoring uh, 70 runs uh Sa- uh swami baba when they're playing simba i think Ka- Ka- karan mm. karan came in and uh, he batted well he started off very well mm. but uh, got out in unlucky so it was a soft dismissal then he came in and took uh, four wickets that won the match for for them uh we've got also you yourself you did you you put on a very good uh, performance and luckily you didn't uh, you didn't win so 
what do you think is the uh, impact of the pros in uh, in our cricket uh, league? As you know, the pros are coming. It's very good thing because competition will high. Yes. Competition competition will be high. It means uh, we lost the match last Sunday, and then we learned something. That's why we are working on the pros. So we have three pros now. Uh, you are in Rwaraka. In Rwaraka. Who are you? Uh, Yogesh Savan and Anish Chaudhary and Maxwell Swaminathan. So these three pros are from Mumbai, and then uh, Maxwell was not there on last Sunday due to some. Uh, Mesh was there in Mumbai, so he will join the coming Sunday. The next Sunday we we'll, we have a bye, so next next he still Sunday. Still have his goal, he'll have yeah, a yeah, time to, yeah, yeah. to, to, to so get in. So we have also good team now. Uh, I think uh, we will do something different this year. Yeah. So thank you very much, uh, Pushka, for your time to share with us your experience in the league, your expectation in the in in, in the league. We just hope that this is going to be another season yeah. that everybody will be talking about uh, Pushka. So thank you very much and all the best. Our viewers, that was uh, Pushka Shama, Ruaraka's main batsman. He was, last year, he was last year's top scorer. And we're just hoping that uh, this season is going to have another wonderful season. Until the next time, I'll uh, see you and before. Before leaving, I'll just kindly ask you once again, please subscribe to our page, share widely, and like our videos. So until next time, thank you very much. Good evening.